Hi, this is a quick tutorial showing you how to set up live to communicate with Liquid Notes on a Mac. If there is no IAC bus installed on your computer, please watch our tutorial video about the installation of an IAC bus first. But now this is our song in live and we want to work on it with Liquid Notes. <laughs> The song was saved as a multi-track MIDI file. This means that the entire arrangement of instruments is packed into one file. But Live cannot export a multi-track MIDI file. That's why you either have to export multiple single-track MIDI files and combine them afterwards with a third-party program, or you may only want to work with single-track MIDI files in the first place. Very soon, Liquid Notes will be able to handle multiple single-track MIDI files anyway. But for now, we've combined all our single tracks into one MIDI file and we simply drag it onto the Liquid Notes window. Simply done like this. So the wizard is opening next. And we choose Live as our sound output source. So this is the result of the track type analysis. It's correct and so we click on Finish. Now, next let's take a look at the instrument selection where we can find the output ports and the output channels for each track. So for each track we now have to assign each input channel in live to the corresponding output channel in Liquid Notes. Simply put, the number of the input channel in live has to match the number of the respective output channel in Liquid Notes. And Liquid Notes automatically assigns channels to tracks in an ascending order. And that's how it should be configured in Live 2. Now in Live we're switching to the session view and we activate in and out here. Okay, track 1 should now be listening to channel 1, track 2 to channel 2 and so forth. And finally we enable record for all tracks holding down the command key and clicking on the record buttons. All right, that's it. The connection has been established and when you play the song from Liquid Notes, you will now hear it through live. Thanks for watching.